just going over a hand real quick where I just doubled up to 6k. Um, we got aces somewhere. Okay, here we go. Um, we're pretty early in position, so I just limp, limp, hoping someone will raise. No one raises, which isn't optimal. Um, but we get to the flop and we check to the guy who's in position. Um, then he see bets to 420, and instantly I think he has um, at least a jack. So this guy calls, I think he has a jack to or a draw. Um, so I just min raise to 840. Um, this guy calls. Um, not putting him on anything crushing me right now. Um, if he was crushing me, he would probably just ship it here because I just put in a third of my stack and I'm probably going to call him anyway. Um, and then this guy folds right here. Um, we'll fold that. Um, then the King of Diamonds comes, which is a pretty good card for my hand. Um, unless he was calling me with um, a flush draw or a jack king. Um, so I just decided to ship it here, hoping to get a crying call from a jack. Um, and then he doesn't really think too long, and he calls me. And he has the king with the ten of diamonds, and we river trips. So he's in a pretty bad spot there on the turn. Um, and by limping preflop, um, he couldn't really put us on a hand that could be a king on the turn. So he must have been pretty happy when he spiked his king with a flush draw, probably putting us on like ace jack or something, um, or at least like jack 10. Um, and we scoop, which is pretty nice. Okay, gotta get back to the game. Uh oh, he ships it, not calling. Ace king, ace queen, jack queen to fold. And ace comes, so we're gonna chop. That four actually made the chop. Um, the kicker still played until the fourth game. Um, he was drawing to a queen or four, so he got pretty lucky there. Um, that might be all for this video. Um, just showing you how to get paid off with your aces, that's all.